In this video, we are going to discuss about network devices. So what are network devices? Network devices are the hardware devices that are used to connect the different components of network like computers, laptops, servers, fax machines, printers together to form the computer network. These devices transmit data in a fast, secure and correct way. Why do we say correct way? Because the data that needs to be transmitted should not have any error when it reaches its destination. Now these devices can help in transmitting the data over the same network or different network. The devices that transmit data over the same network are called inter-network devices and those that transmit data over different networks are called intranetwork devices. So examples of inter-network devices could be modems or routers whereas gateways and switches could be example of intranetwork devices. In this video, we are going to discuss different types of internetwork and intranetwork devices. Let's start with the modem. Modem is a very basic, most essential network device that every device that is connected to the network must be having. Let's first see what is digital data and what is analog data. Okay. So, the data that is being transferred over the wires is analog data. In previous videos, we have discussed about uh, copper wires, optical wires or even the unguided media. So, the data travels in the form of analog data. However, within the computer, the data transmission takes place in form of digital data. Now, when the computer needs to transmit data over the computer network, it will send the data in form of digital waves, but it has to be transmitted in the form of analog wave. This is where the modem comes in. Modem is actually a combination of two devices, a modulator on a demodulator. What does the modulator do? It converts the digital data into the analog data when the computer is sending information over the network. What does the demodulator do? It will convert the analog data that it receives from the network and converts it into digital data so that it can be read by the computer. Now let's see what are the types of modems. Now the modem can be categorized in different ways. First and foremost the direction in which it is transmitting the data, then it is the type of connection that it is using plus the transmission mode. Here for this video we will only concern ourselves with the types of modem depending on the direction in which it is transferring the data. Now here there will be three types of modems, simplex, half duplex and full duplex. What is a simplex? Simplex is the modem can transmit the data only in one direction, either from the computer to the network or network to the computer. So essentially the modem is, the simplex modem is either a modulator or a demodulator. What happens in half duplex mode? In half duplex mode, the modem has the capacity to act as a modulator as well as a demodulator. But at any given point of time, either it will act as modulator, that means it will convert the digital data into the analog data or it will act as a demodulator, which is it will convert the data from analog to digital. Now what is the third and the final thing? That is the full duplex. A full duplex modem can transmit data in both the directions at the same time. So in this video, we have learned what the different types of modems are and how these modems work. In the next video, we are going to discuss about the Ethernet cards.